All right, welcome back. So, tragic story on the heels of another tragic story, but we had this itch, uh, situation out in Arkansas this past week where Sydney Sutherland, who's a 25-year-old woman, went out jogging. She went missing. Days later, they found her body. DNA confirms it was her. She was murdered. There's a farmer, uh, a neighbor, who's been arrested in connection with it. Uh, it just sick that this keeps happening and i hate that we have to talk about it but i'm thrilled at least that we get to talk about it with someone who can help and someone who i have had to talk about similar scenarios with um before but joining us to discuss this is ceo and founder of alexo athletica amy robbins amy good to see you hey drew it's great to be on i like you said i hate that it has to be under these circumstances but I'm, I'm so thankful that you're highlighting this and bringing attention to what's going on and giving people some, some solutions to this, not just presenting the story, but actually presenting a solution. So I appreciate it. And I'm glad to be on with you. Absolutely. Well, it does need to be out there. And I want to talk about your company, which is a solution for this, or, or at least a, you know, part of a solution for this. But, but just kind of an obvious question, and, and obviously, I mean, the, the answer is clear that there is an issue and there is a big problem with this, but how vulnerable are women in particular going out and running on their own, and, and particularly when they're longer runs? Like, I feel like when you're, you're doing a shorter run, you know, you do it in more pop, populated areas where there's more people around, but you do a longer run and you're kind of stuck with having to, like, find you know, you're going to go through some isolated areas and whatnot. How vulnerable are women, though, when they do this? Because it keeps happening. Yeah, well, it does keep happening. Um, in fact, statistics show us right now that 84% of women runners and joggers um, and walkers have expressed some form of harassment. And they say that they have actually felt their safety be threatened. I personally was one of those women as well. Um, just like you said, I was training for a marathon. So I was really kind of limited on the hours that I could get up and run. So a lot of women are having to go really early in the morning or late at night to get those long runs in. And when you're by yourself and you don't have a self-defense tool on your body, you really are leaving yourself open um, to anything that can happen. I mean, look in this case, this is not um, an isolated case. We you're seeing this happen. It happened with uh, Molly Tibbetts, Karina Vetrano, Wendy Martinez. The list can go on and on of women who go out for a run and never return. And so I never wanted to see this happen again, which is exactly why I created my company, Alexa Athletica. We actually built in the ability for women to carry some form of self-defense tool on their body while they're running. So whether that's mace, whether that's taser, or whether it's a firearm, if you've got a license to carry, we want you to be trained. We want you to be armed. We want you to be able to carry confidently knowing that you can take safety um, into your own hands and you're responsible for your own safety. Yeah, I love it. Well, and it's such... And I mean, my wife has a, has a pair of your leggings. Uh, like it's an amazing <laughs> company. Um, she doesn't carry yet, though. We've got to work on that. But but gotta work on that. We uh, well, baby steps. We're gonna get there. Um, we're so busy around here. I don't think. I mean, none of us leave the house anymore. Anyway, it's twenty twenty. <laughs> but but I mean, you created this awesome awesome company, and and I love what you just said there because we've talked about it before on my old show. But you know, not everyone is gonna carry a firearm, and that's okay. We recommend right. it. I like it. I mean, I think you should you should exercise that right. But I also just was teaching a course this weekend for a small private course and, and letting them letting them know it's not for everyone. This is not I mean, it's a big responsibility. So but if you don't want to go down that path, there's other options. There's there's totally. other, there, all these pockets. You can put other stuff in there. There's pepper spray. You don't have to just be the old yeah. lady spraying people who aren't wearing a mask in a, in a public park. That's true. That's like, true. You, you, you could use it for self-defense and what it's actually made for. Um, so I love that you guys do that. What Tell, tell the audience, though, because, you know, we've got kind of a new audience. We've got some of the old audience and a new audience. Yeah. What are your your best products, um, the biggest sellers that, that tend to fly well, off the shelves? We, we started out, um, of course, as a line that concentrated on runners. So our number one selling product was, of course, our leggings. But we realized very quickly that as the weather heats up, sometimes the leggings aren't the best option. So we've expanded our line greatly since I last spoke with you. We have shorts, biking shorts, running shorts, um, a brand new athletic skirt that just hit the market and it flew off the shelves within a week. Um, so we, we basically are the only active lifestyle brand that is on the market that's doing this, um, that is truly 
truly creating an entire uh, lifestyle around women being able to dress comfortably and stay safe while they are wearing their active wear clothes. So um, yeah, definitely check us out. You know, we did get hit like uh, so many manufacturing companies did with COVID. So unfortunately we were a little limited in what we were able to get in after COVID. And so our stuff did fly off the shelf, but if we don't have your size in stock, we're getting restocked here very quickly. And then we'll have a ton of new stuff coming for the, um, for the fall and for black Friday and Christmas. So definitely stay tuned for that. That's awesome. No. Yeah. I mean, obviously I'm sure that was a difficult struggle like everyone else getting yep. stuff in during COVID delay. At least now the nice thing is as much as it sucks in its own right is, is people kind of expect delays. Um, which, which no one loves. Like when Amazon went, you know, when prime went to is more than two days. was like, what? Like it's going to take three days to get here. Like this is BS. And we're here and what's going on with the U S postal service. And I am here to tell you as a small business owner, the problem and the struggle is real with the U S postal service. Some of our packages are taking up to three to four weeks uh, to get delivered to people. And so it is, it truly is, um, a problem. And you know, it's, it's, if you don't want to pay for the more expensive shipping with UPS and FedEx, USPS, um, is an option, but unfortunately it's, they're severely delayed right now as well due to COVID. So yeah. Yeah. COVID and just, just being who they are for, (laughs) for for so long. (laughs) Um, we, we've got to figure it. Well, you, you mentioned new products coming out in the fall. Like, are there some, some new things that people can expect? Anything you can tell us about? Yeah. So we're really excited because like I said, we're expanding our line to encompass an entire lifestyle surrounding of reliability and preparedness. And so we've got everything from these amazing jogger pants that are coming out to new prints, um, and new styles with our leggings, uh, probably not going to be bringing shorts back while the weather cools down, but we'll have all these other things. And then we're also going to be expanding to not just a female line. So I will definitely give you more information on that when we're ready to release our men's line. So a lot of exciting things happening with Alexo. And um, as we're seeing this rise, people go out and get their license to carry. We want to be that brand that is there for you, creating the best products on the market to allow you to comfortably conceal whatever it is that you're wanting to carry to stay safe. That's awesome. I'm excited to hear that you're going to start giving some love to the men because yeah, here's, and here we've got to work on this. Uh, like this is my, this is my suggestion. Not that my suggestion matters, okay. but I live in board shorts like every day, like under this desk is either board shorts or it's, it's just board shorts. So, but board shorts suck for, for concealed carry because there's nothing to, well, to, to fasten. So, so let's, 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 uh, board shorts matter. That's a new hashtag. We've got you covered. We've got, we, we, we might have something in the works that will solve that problem for you. I love it. I love it. That would, you're already my hero. That would make you even more of my hero. Thank you for everything you're doing. We love it. Thanks for joining us today. Thanks, Drew. It's great to be on. Absolutely. Hey, guys, go, go to alexoathletica.com. Like Amy said, that, you know, there might be some delays because of COVID, but I promise you're going to love this stuff. I, again, my wife has it. I have friends who have it. Uh, you, you're, you're just going to love it. You, you'll, you'll not be sad that you went there. Uh, thanks for all of you joining in today. Great show. Lot, we packed a lot in. There's was, there was a lot to get to, and I feel like we've got a lot we've got to carry over into tomorrow. But great great set of, uh, slate of shows coming up. Jesse Kelly still this week. Deanna Lorraine, Adele Nazarian, several other great guests. And remember, folks, when we discuss it with them, we discuss it with you. We've all got our opinions. We've got our own ideas, and that's okay. It's important that we do that and we discuss it fairly. So this is my show. Mammoth Nation is the discount club for conservatives. You get great discounts on name brand products and services, and the proceeds help candidates who support the right causes. Plus, the money you save from just one purchase can pay for your entire membership. Liberal Democrats are destroying America, and we can't let Joe Biden be president. It's time to join the fight. Strength in numbers. We give the silent majority a resounding voice. Go to mammothnation.com and let's win this fight together.